On November 18, 1883 America experienced two noons. Why? Because scientists decided to rewrite time itself. Before this day, every town kept its own local solar time. No two clocks matched. Noon in one city could be 15 minutes different from the next. Travel was chaos. Science was frustrated. And railroads. A disaster waiting to happen. Trains crashed because schedules couldn't be trusted. Astronomers couldn't sync observations. And businesses couldn't coordinate across distances. The United States was growing. But time was falling apart. So scientists, telegraph operators, and railroad engineers united to attempt something unthinkable, standardize the entire continent's time into four zones. At exactly Sunday noon, November 18, 1883 the telegraph fired signals across the nation and clocks were reset everywhere. Some towns saw the clock jump forward. Others backwards. Creating the legendary day of two noons. In one moment, America entered the age of synchronized science. This single decision enabled precision railways, coordinated power grids, modern astronomy, global telecommunications, and eventually GPS satellites and the internet itself. Time became a technology not just the position of the sun. Today, the network that keeps your phone's clock accurate relies on atomic clocks, quantum physics, and GPS satellites orbiting 20,000 kilometers above Earth. All of that traces back to this quiet November morning when scientists and engineers asked a radical question, if time was being invented today, would we design it differently?